Good evening and welcome to War Thunder's website. We're up for some dev blog season because Operation Summer is coming on the 7th of August. It's going to be a big one, so let's get started with the first dev blog of the season. For the uh, low tier air re uh, premium vehicle or reward vehicle for this event, we have the Arado AR196A3. The Arado AR196 was the last combat float plane built in Europe. It was obsolescent by the end of World War II, but during the war, this airplane served Germany well in all theaters of operation. The type flew in the Atlantic and Indian Oceans and the Mediterranean, Baltic, Aegean, Black, and North Seas. The AR-196 replaced the lackluster HE-114, which did not handle well in the water and was too slow and vulnerable. In 1936, the Reich Air Ministry spec a two-seat aircraft powered by a single 800 to 900 horsepower engine with either a single or twin float arrangement. While four companies submitted designs, only the Arado design was a monoplane configuration with all the performance improvements that may imply. A competing design by Focke-Wulf initially obtained a small production contract, but was subsequently discontinued when the Arado design soundly outclassed it. A pre-production run of Arado AR-196A0s totaled 10 planes and was delivered in November 1938. The production A1 models began to be delivered by June 1939. These models sported two forward-firing wing-mounted 20mm MGFF cannon, one rifle caliber MG-17 mounted in the nose, and either one or two turreted rifle caliber machine guns for the second seat. It could also haul two 50 kilogram bombs for when you need to not kill something loudly. The Arado AR-196 was often carried by German warships, including the Admiral Graf Spee. She, was, she also operated coastal patrols from land bases, and a pair of the A-2 models based in Alberg, Denmark, actually captured a British sub, the HMS SEAL. And I quote... A notable action occurred on May 5, 1940, when two AR-196A2s from Alberg, Denmark, captured a British submarine. The HMS SEAL was sowing mines in a narrow waterway called the Kattegat when it struck one of its own mines. Drawn to the commotion, patrolling Arados attacked the sub with guns and bombs, and inflicted such damage that the boat could not submerge. One of the Arados landed alongside the stricken sub, and her captain surrendered to the pilot. Production of the Arado AR-196 ended in August 1944 with a total run of 526 aircraft, excluding prototypes and pre-production models. In a strange quirk of either paperwork mishandling or fate, the A-3 model, represented in War Thunder, actually came after the A-4 model. The final production version was the A-5. In War Thunder, the AR-196A3 will be a Rank 1 premium vehicle armed with two 20mm MGFF cannons, one MG-17 rifle caliber machine gun, and a single 7.92mm machine gun in the defensive turret. This will be an interesting one, at least fun for those that are after a low-tier air, uh, air option, so get in there for the Operation Summer and pick up a, a new uh, shiny new premium Rank 1 German aircraft. Have a great night.